My name is Walter O'Brien, and I'm a genius. Walter! Einstein had an IQ of 165. Mine's 197. Sign them, and I'll tell you how I hacked into NASA. Corporal to command. We have Scorpion. He's just a kid. My character is Walter O'Brien. He has uh, an IQ of 197, which I suppose is the biggest salesman um, technique for watching the show, just because it's such a, a high level of IQ. So you, you join the actual story years later on down the line when he's created this company called Scorpion, which is essentially for like-minded geniuses to solve problems. At the start, it's really for him navigating his life and his way in the world, and he brings different people with really, really intelligent um, high, high IQs as well. So all with geniuses, and he tries to kind of matriculate them and make sure that they're, they have some kind of belonging uh, in the world. Whoa, 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 what are you doing? I got this. Just not necessarily the most normal people on the planet. Why are you stealing electricity? Just borrowing it. I thought we were paying the bills after the credit national job. I worked for three days on this great loss algorithm. You got credit lost risk. in the numbers and you forgot to pay the electric bill. Homeland Security, we're looking for Walter O'Brien. I like, um, I like the fact that my character has uh, ostensibly an emotional um, problem terms of communicating communicating his feelings and his emotions which is um very is very different from how you normally would envisage uh somebody on tv or a focal character on tv being represented major gallo homeland security i need to commandeer your diner for a national emergency i'm hacking into airport security i'm going to rotate your cameras to point at the monitors i'm not comfortable with you hacking into anything at this airport then don't make it so easy yes very very intimidating knowing that you're speaking to, because that's what the show is. It's not about, hey, by the way, this show is about somebody who goes out, fights crime. Essentially, it's about geniuses. <laughs> it's about leader, about all these other people within uh, the show. But he definitely allayed my fears meeting somebody who I'm really representing. But the, the, the thing that we have to be aware of is that he's a fictitious representation of a real life guy. And that helps us glue together the, this emotional um, difficulty that we have, that he has a huge amount of emotion, but it's just the problem um, representing that and showing that. Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm reading uh, 53 pages that I wouldn't be doing every eight episodes, <laughs> every eight days. Oh What's that, done it? <laughs> done it. It's my block string <laughs> chaos theory.